Hey, so here is two snippets from today's training. Um, I walked her with another dog named Valentino. I didn't get uh, footage of it. I apologize. Um, but I wanted to walk her with another dog in close proximity, not only for her benefit, but also for Valentino's benefit. Um, and she did really well um, walking right next to me and, and focusing. Now, here, she hates this. I'm going to be honest. Um, this is where it's tolerance building. Truly and honestly, it's how do I settle in this type of space? So we are actually off to the side, kind of in front of my office, where she can see people come in and out. And you can just tell she is unsettled and like, wait, but people are moving. And wait, I have to keep track of everyone. Wait, there's the front door. Um, I was doing my notes, uh, training notes for the day. And you can just see where she's just like, oh, come on, can we move? Why, what are we doing? Um, she does eventually sit a couple times. Um, and this is sped up and I have little snippets cut out because we do a couple walking around sessions when she just couldn't, when it was a little too much for her. Um, I was eating a croissant and she was like, oh, hello, let me lick it for you. Um, so she didn't get it, but she was definitely also kind of interested in that distraction. But for the most part, she did really well in building up that tolerance. Now, today was a really hot day. And instead of taking her to a park, um, I took one of our playrooms over and she got to run in this playroom. It's giant. Um, she had an absolute blast and you can kind of see her happy tail and her wiggles um i had a, a ball that lights up um and then i have a, a squeaky moo cow toy um we did a couple name games we did a couple recall capacities um i just really wanted when we were in here work on just fun play um seeing her happy and relaxed uh, after a training session or after a hard session in the lobby it's always nice to have her just kind of <sighs> take a big sigh of relief. Um, but we always reinforce good skills while we're in here. Um, she really can run. And what's fun and exciting about this is um, kind of the difference of being in a park is that I was able to work on letting her just run and not worry about her being close hanged by a 30 foot lead. Um, we'll probably, as the summer gets a little bit hotter, we'll probably be using this room a little bit more. Um, and that's where I might have another dog or some other built in distractions just to work on it. But, um, this is the first time I've really gotten to seeing her just let loose and do spins and be crazy and goofy. Um, and you can see right here, I'm working on her impulse for going after the ball. Um, but also playing with her with impulse. So I hope you guys are doing well. Um, let me know if you have any questions and it was a really good day for her.